one of two cardiothoracic surgeons in the House of Representatives, Representative Bashan has shown an unwavering commitment to defend our specialty and all of surgery in the face of significant regulatory challenges. Dr. Bashan led the congressional effort to block CMS from making a dangerous change in how CMS pays surgeons. Without his intervention, CMS proposal to eliminate global surgical payments would have been detrimental to beneficiary care, hindered efforts to improve and coordinate health care and increase administrative burdens. Enacting truly patient-centered health care reforms that protect the patient-doctor relationship is among his top legislative priorities, and he's continued to be a champion for surgeons and patients alike. We're proud to recognize Dr. Bashan, an STS member, with the inaugural STS Legislator of the Year Award, and please thank me. Please join me in thanking him for his dedication. So I was an intern on his service, and uh, the fellow, it was like July 3rd or 4th, okay? And uh, he had a level of expectation, of course, about, uh, on patient rounds, about are the quality, I'll just say this, the quality of our presentation. <laughs> and uh, we didn't need it. And so, of course, we didn't know. I'm the intern, and the fellow was new, also his first year fellow, and uh, Gordon, after the end of that, he goes, he said it uh, more aggressively than I'll say it today, but he said essentially that, that if you guys don't shape up, you're not going to make it another month in this program. And I was an intern in my first month, and uh, I had three months of cardiothoracic surgery, and subsequently him and I became friends, and obviously he accepted, he accepted me into this program, and he's a, he's a great guy. But um, from that, from there, to uh, my chairman, uh, uh, former future chairman, saying that I might not make it another month. <laughs> and that is, to this award today it is, is something I could have never imagined. And uh, I can't tell you how grateful I am for this. I, I mean that. And uh, getting to meet you all. And, uh, you know, over the years since I've been in Congress, many of the people that uh, I sat as during my general surgery residency and cardiac surgery residency, reading their chapters and textbooks. I've had the opportunity to meet through doing this job. Uh, it's just been uh, just been an amazing journey. Uh, and uh, thank you very much for those kind words about uh, global surgical payments. I also want to give a shout out to a, a doctor named Mommy Barrett from California uh, on the Democrat side because we have to have a bipartisan effort to make this happen. And uh, you know, I convinced Speaker Boehner and our leadership, and he convinced Ms. Pelosi and their leadership that what CMS was doing was a very bad idea, and we actually didn't have a very difficult time convincing them, but we did. And that's really an amazing thing where two, two members of Congress uh, can have an impact on a nation like that. Imagine the impact had CMS eliminated global surgical payments, and so it's humbling to me uh, to be part of that. And, uh, this will be front and center on my desk uh, in my office. Uh, it's greatly appreciated. Uh, I also appreciate your ongoing input. Like I said in the room in further discussion, it is critically important for people like you all that are actually in the, in the field practicing our specialty to be here in Washington and uh, talking to legislators uh, and talking to people in the executive branch about the issues that affect your ability to take care of people. And uh, people like me, I'm not a hard sell, right? You, you can call me up and I'm saying, God, I'll get Teresa, my chief of staff, on that one and we'll go from there. And, but uh, other legislators who are, agree with the direction and supportive of, uh, of medicine, um, if they're not in healthcare, it's important for you to talk to them directly and, and really pitch it. And make sure that they understand the significance of the issue. And, uh, and when you do that, I think we, we have a good chance of uh, going in the right direction.